Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play The Elder Scrolls Online. So I thought today we'd go and check out the Prophet, see what he's up to. Um, he's up here somewhere, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess we're taking the long road here. So he appeared to us a while back, uh, randomly when we were out on our adventures. So, uh, he said, come see me in the future. So I think we'll go do that. We'll see what he's up to here. So last time, if you uh, didn't watch it, because uh, I decided to break it on to another little series, a sub-series kind of thing. That way it doesn't really distract from this one. Uh, is the uh, PvP, basically. So I did uh, the Citadel. Uh, Cyrodiil? Cyrodiil, I think that's more like that. Um, and uh, I got a couple levels out of it. So we're actually level uh, 22 now, which is pretty cool. And, uh, yeah, so we have 18 skill points. A lot of that actually came because we were hunting down sky shards all over the place. So if we go down to our sky shard list here, I love this little list. We go to, there we go. So you can see I've gotten 8 of 15 from the DC area, 2 of 15 from the EP, which is us, which is kind of funny. Uh, so I spent more time getting that. Um, they also had, um... And quite a bit of uh, the delves and stuff like that. So I just had a lot of fun there. I did more PvE than PvP there, but I did break it down because it was its own zone and it's, it's not like its own DLC expansion, etc. But I felt like it needs its own thing because if I do Battlegrounds and things like that as well, I feel like it's more like a good list for that. So uh, that's, that's what I decided anyways. Maybe I should check to see if we got any... Oh, and uh, so you get two new uh, skill lines here. You got the uh, Alliance uh, War... Uh, well... It's the Alliance War, basically. You got Assault and Support, which is really cool. Um, I think the one I would like to get is level 5 here. So you get this one, 30% movement there. We also have this one, which uh, gains major gallop at, at all times, increasing your mount speed by 30%, which is pretty nice. So I think my mount should be actually faster. It feels faster. And uh, I think if you upgrade this again, you don't actually get 30. I think that's just uh, the other things boost up. I could be wrong. But I don't think it goes to like 60%. I think that's just the permit 30. But uh, you get uh, this ability that you can use quite often here, which is uh, the the uh, rapid maneuver. So this is a good one to put, say, on your other bar. Or I think some people might use an add-on that adds and removes that off your bar for you. So I might look into that as well. Um, but uh, either way, yeah, that was probably the best part of actually doing that was getting that. Uh, let's check our racial here. Increase your stamina recovery by oh yeah let's let's put a point in there for sure then, and let's check our alliance. Uh, nothing new there. Um, how is our armor? Our armor is starting to go uh, medium finally a little bit more now, which is nice. Uh, so oh yeah, look at that bonus now. So we have a lot of pieces on here. Current bonus is six. Yeah, so we have six pieces basically. Okay, so let's do that. Increase your critical weapon rating by blah blah blah. For each piece of armor you have, sure. And this will go up quite a bit now, too. Reduces, uh, yeah, because of all the pieces I guess we have. Uh, so let's go ahead and, yeah, let's put some points into these guys. This one increases your stamina recovery, blah, blah, blah. Each you know, reduces the stamina of your abilities. Okay. It reduces the sneak by 4% for each piece and medium armor equip. Current bonus reduces the size of your detection area while sneaking. That's actually really good even just for PvP, to be fair. There we go. We'll just dump those uh, skills into there because I think that'll be worth it. And, ooh, this one has uh, skills to it, too. Reduce the cost of sneak. That's actually cool. Uh, increase your chance for a successful pit pocket. Uh, I'll leave those alone now, but that's really cool. Uh, Fighters Guild. Uh, we're just looking at their passes more than anything. Okay, nothing really there. And then uh, after that's basically, you know, your class stuff. But uh, we're not really spending on the passives yet anyways. Yeah, I think we're good there for now. You grant one ultimate, blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's keep going here. So, the prophet it is. Let's see what he's up to today. It is good to see you again. And I do see you in my own way. You're a wound in time, a tear in reality that shouldn't exist, and cannot long endure. Oh my, uh, why are you speaking riddles? Fate speaks in riddles. Your fate was written in the scrolls long ago. It is entwined with the fate of the five companions. I have finally located Lyris Titanborn in Cold Harbor. Is she safe? She works a terrible forge. Under the lash of the great deceiver, Molog Baal. Her soul is in great danger. You must go to her. 
I can manifest a gate to that dark realm, but you must go quickly. Okay, so open the gate and we'll go. Tread carefully in Molog Baal's realm. You are important. The scrolls have so named you. Oh, wow. Okay. What happened to Lyris after we uh, escaped Cold Harbor? After Lyris took my place in the Wailing Prison so that we might escape, the Daedra moved her to the Foundry of Woe. It is a place of torment and despair. She toils endlessly making weapons for the enemy. How do you know this? The God of Schemes invaded my mind many times during my imprisonment. It was a tortuous experience, but by forcing his way into my mind, he inadvertently opened his own thoughts to me, and thus created a chink in his own armor. What do you mean? We are connected, he and I. With concentration, I can see through his eyes. He feels my presence, and it fills him with rage. <laughs> when you enter the foundry to recover Lyris, I can keep his attention focused on me. He will be blind to you for a time. Isn't that dangerous? It will be a far greater danger for you to enter Cold Harbor without this distraction. It is Molog Baal's realm, and his power there is great. I will endeavor to distract him in this manner whenever you travel there. Okay. Ooh, this time it's a portal. I'm not being forced there, huh? There we go. Oh. Free chunk. There we go. We good here? Look at these poor guys. Wow, they're like dead. Okay, so we are here. We are so we are uh, back in Cold Harbor. It's like we're never coming back here. Oh, another thing I did is I got a nice uh, helmet. I just thought I'd show it off. I was really happy about it. But we got a Mufit thingy mavaver. Um, why can't I see my inventory? There we go. So I got this one. It's actually from a quest. It was just like a drop in a kind of like a little cache or whatever. But uh, I thought it was pretty cool. I guess I got another piece of gear there that also gives you the bonus there. So that's pretty cool. But, hey, it was just my first purple, so I wanted to make sure I showed that off. You know, we're getting more blues here from time to time, which is pretty cool, too. Um, so we got this thing. Um, average, minimum, so it's not really worth the much. Okay. Yeah, more, a lot of those old ones I don't think are worth a lot anyways, but... You. You're alive. Are you really here, or is this another trick? It's me the prophet sends me to find you. And he's still alive. Thank the gods. But you... You can't stay. You have to leave before they find you here. I'm not leaving without you. You don't understand. They've done something to me. I can't leave. What do you mean? It's hard to describe. My memories, my feelings, they've, they've been fragmented, ripped apart. And all the fragmented pieces have been locked away in different parts of the foundry. Then we'll retrieve them. I tried. The Daedra took everything. My willpower, my courage, my sense of self. I'm an empty shell. And the fragments are reflections of my worst fears and most painful memories. I, I can't. I, I don't think I can face them. But you're an empty shell, so you're a reflection of your worst fears and most painful memories. I don't think I can face them. So my willpower, my courage, and my sense of self is gone, right? She's an empty shell. So like, and then the way she talks with emotion. You look at her. <laughs> she looks like she's about to cry. <laughs> it just does not add up, to be honest. Uh, we'll face them together. I'll do my best. Lead on. Okay. Drug addicts. Okay, these are like the soul stuff, I guess. Anyways, let's, uh, we'll go ahead and kick some ass here. Okay, oh, I guess we can loot you if we need to. Ooh, there's more containers here. Do, 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 do. Okay. Oh, These lost are... souls are barely aware of their humanity. Yeah, you to even beat them back to work, slave! I think I'm a slave. At least these ones who call me a slave, I can take them out. But it's like, I want more options to take out. Oh, I'm using this. I must have. There you go. 
Must have flipped out at one point. Oh, I thought that was like this iron ore. It's like a combine here. It looks like my childhood home in Skyrim. My parents' graves. My mother died in childbirth. My father was distant. Cold. I think he blamed me for my mother's death. I ran off to become a mercenary when I was 16. Really? I never 16? Saw my father again. I thought you guys were having kids at like he was 10. Murdered by an old enemy. Father? Oh, hello. Papa. Is that you? So into this burnt out house. Oh my. Bleed you bastard! Die like the monster you are! <laughs> There you go. Who are you? Why does Lyris walk with you? I'm here to help Lyris. Who are you? In life, I was Gyalda, father to Lyris. My spirit was torn from its rest and brought to this foul place. The Daedra forced me to experience my own murder again and again. I thought my torment would never end. Damn. They're using you to keep Lyris shackled to Cold Harbor. I don't understand. Lyris was always a free spirit. Why would my presence bind her here? She blames herself for your death. Lyris, is this true, child? You were always so cold. So distant. My mother died giving me life. It was my fault. I should never have been born. Lyris, Sounds good to me. The blood of giants flows through my veins. Your mother was a Nord. I gave her my seed without thought for her safety. That's why she died. Not because of you, child. Because of me. I thought you blamed me. You... You couldn't even look at me, Papa. Do you not see? When I looked at you, I saw her face. I loved her, child. Just as I love you. More than life itself. We cannot change the past, nor should we cling to it. You must not let these feelings haunt you. Let them go. Let me go. I love you too, Papa. Rest now. Be at peace. I guess he didn't want to put his seed He's in gone. Her. Come on, let's get out of here. That's why he avoided looking at her, apparently. <laughs> Anyways. This is a labyrinth of hopelessness built to compound the misery of those who labor here. You know... Just because, you know, somebody looks like your wife doesn't mean you have to be cold and distant to them. What is this? <gasps> it's her gear. Did you get all the pieces? Yeah, I stashed them in the footlockers all around camp. I bet the commander makes her run 50 laps this time. 50? Let's hope the beast gets a lashing. Damn. All right, let's get back to it. Act natural. Oh, they're heading back to the camp. So get your armor. Did you find something? I believe this armor belongs to you. I can't believe it. This armor is who I am. It's what I am. A warrior without her armor is like a bear without claws. Uh, suit up. It's like, I'll wait and watch. Oh, yeah. Excellent. I'm ready. Okay. Okay, so we'll keep going here. Watch your step. All the mining has made these tunnels unstable. dead end but is there anything on the dead end no there really isn't <laughs> it just it seems so dead endish it was like hmm okay 
Abner Thorn, you traitorous bastard. I should have expected to find you here. Don't be a fool, Titanborn. I'm trying to help you. Your hatred poisons you. Warriors are like steel. When you lose your temper, you lose your worth. Help me. You betrayed us all, then went back to licking Money Marco's boot before the smoke cleared. I did what I had to do. And as a show of my good intentions, I have a gift for you. But be warned, Cold Harbor will not give it up easily. Is that... Sure, Bones, it is. Vestige, that's my battle axe. Any cute little dinosaurs guarding it? That's even cuter. Yeah, I guess if you don't want it, I'll take it. Oh, it's good to have you back. My axe. Oh, it feels good to have it back. It's part of me. Losing it was like losing an arm. Why would Tharn try to help you? I don't know. I don't trust him and I never will. But it's odd. <laughs> the blind hatred I felt when I saw him. I could have strangled him with my bare hands. But now, I think he was right. That hatred was poisoning me. How do you feel now? Better. Stronger. Almost whole again. <laughs> Isn't that strange? I feel powerful enough to take on Umaril the Unfeathered himself. I feel like a warrior again. What's next? We're not done yet. We need to keep moving forward. The passage is blocked by a rock slide. But now that I have my axe back, I might be able to break through it. Let's check it out. Where are we going? Oh, right here. Stand back. Oh, we just have to go near. Your I was like, pile of there's nothing to click. Stop me now. Damn, girl. So many daydream beasties, so little time. We need to keep moving. Ah. Oh, come on. I thought I was out of there. For once, I thought I did good. She burned up. That's what you get dealing with me. I will burn you up. Did you hear that? It sounded like... No. It couldn't be. Was it your mother? <laughs> what is this thing? Sai. What's happened to you? What have they done? Lyris. Lyris. I can see you. Are you really there? Sai, it's me. We're seeing some kind of vision of you. Do you know where you are? I... I don't know. They're torturing me. They want the Amulet of Kings. Want me to tell them where it's hidden. But I haven't broken. Not yet. Sai, you need to hold on. We're going to find you. I'll make sure of it. We'll find you. Somehow we'll get you out of there. Sai? Sai! No! Bring him back, you bastards! That was no trick. That was Sai Sahan. Uh, are you going to be all right? Sai's a friend. Maybe my best friend. We need to find him and get him out of there. Uh, there must be a way to find out where they're keeping him. We need to tell the Prophet about this. He'll know what to do. But first, we need to find a way out of here. 
I don't care what else they throw at us. Nothing is going to keep me from helping Sai. Um, let's go. these designs almost feels like we're in like the bowels of it like some sort of like I don't know like like on a different planet or sp some sort of space something or other you know like it's just, it's a cool design to it like on the moon or something silly you know what I mean it's pretty cool okay So that's actually why I wish there was more like sci-fi MMOs that were like, you know, like these kind of games, like Wildstar, only if that kept going. Um, but because uh, you can do so much new design because you, you're not stuck with one world in a sense, right? You can go to multiple worlds. I have to push through this. Let's go. I mean, heck, that's what they do in World of Warcraft even. Oh, a lot of text we keep getting. It's the source of all my fears. I can hear it whispering to me, taunting me. Well, we'll kill it then. See, it wasn't hard at all. You did it. The voices, the whispering. It's gone. This whole time, it was like watching myself in the distance. I think we're done here. She's not moving with me, but I'm guessing we're done. It's so loud in there. There is Chan. Are you alright? Yes, Prophet, I'm fine. The vestige freed my mind from the dangerous control. Thank the divines. Your loss would have thrown all into chaos. They won't take me again. Not alive, at least. Huh. <laughs> Prophet, Menemarko captured Sai Sahan. He's torturing him to find out where the Amulet of Kings is hidden. We have to rescue him. Okay. You brought Lyris back, and largely intact from the look of her. She's been through a lot. And she would need time to recover. One does not leave such a place unscarred. Uh, so we saw a projection of Sai. What did he say? Did Sai tell you where he is being held? He doesn't know. Marco is torturing him. He wants the Amulet of Kings. Then we must locate him before Menemarco forces him to reveal the Amulet's hiding place. Uh, we saw a projection of Abner Tharn. Did he? I thought he had firmly aligned himself with Menemarco and his worm cult. Curious, I'm curious. So I said, Mermin and Marco want Samuel Kings, why? As you saw in my visions, the amulet's misuse ripped a hole in the barrier that protects Time Real from the forces of oblivion. That damage must be undone, and the amulet is the key. But to find the amulet, we must first locate Sai Sahan. How can we help? For now you must leave me to my meditation. I must set my mind to the task of locating Sai Sahan. Until then, embrace the unknowable. The drops of water cannot know themselves to be a river, yet the river flows on. Uh, one last thing. Why did uh, Molag Bar Bal Bal leave Lyris? Uh, any possibility of escape? Perhaps it was simply arrogance. Perhaps it was all part of his grand scheme. Who can know the logic of a Daedric prince? I will call upon you again when the time is right. Farewell, Vistage. Okay. So, stamina cost. Oh, that's a nice one, maybe. And a skill point. Cool. So, there we have it. Let's check out that one. Um, so, stamina. So, we do have the one that can really deal with that. Oh, they're both kind of low. Oh, that was health. This is stamina. Yeah, let's do it that. Perfect. So, there we go. Now we can go off and do uh, regular uh, programming. <laughs> Mm. 
I think it was starting to get dark in the game. Oh yeah, there you go, it's nighttime. Oh, that's so cool, they just one closed. I love that. Okay, so uh, let me go find a place to um, yeah, do some questing, I guess. Because uh, we have things here. I wonder, I'm going to check the main town, actually, see if there's any quests we can find there and see what we can come up with, to be fair. Come to the harbors. We must speak. There he is again. I'm going to leave that. I'm going to break it up like one at a time anyways, like we do, but uh, he's already bugging us. I don't know why I ran down here, though. There's one down here. Let's see what this one's about. What in the name of Vivek do you put in this stuff? Aye, the divines. The ale servers in this place get uglier by the day. <laughs> I'm looking for a fight. <laughs> Is that right? Well then, sounds to me like you could be one of the Undaunted. The Undaunted? What's that? A league of like-minded adventurers. Every one of us eager for riches and glory. Sound like anyone you know? Yes, so what I do want... you say? Think you can be one of the Undaunted? Uh, let me... I wonder if this is DLC stuff. Yeah, I think it was always part of the game, maybe? From what I can see. Anyways, yeah, I want to be one of the Undaunted. You there sure? you go. Dungeon delving and monster fighting is not for the weak of heart. Oh, okay. It's a skill line. I'm not afraid. Good. But that's the easy part. The hard part is proving yourself. Bungal Grotto seems like a good test. A dark, dank cave you return from. See if you can best whatever's inside. If you survive, come meet me back here, and we'll make it official. Okay, so this is for, uh... Undaunted! Undaunted! undaunted. We, we are undaunted! <laughs> I don't like that. Why are they being weird? It's so cringy. Uh, okay, anyways, um, yeah, so it's a new skill line called Undaunted, a new guild here. So there you go. Cool. So uh, it looks like we actually do a dungeon for this one. Uh, that's what it was talking about, it looked like. So Undaunted, yeah. So uh, enter the blah, 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 improve myself. So. Um, that's a dungeon, I guess. So that requires us campaign overview. No, I meant to do J. Um, so I'm taunted, blah, blah, blah. So it's a dungeon. This quest is located in the dungeon, but to be depleted by four players. Yeah, so we're not going to do that, obviously, yet. But uh, that's what that's for. That's cool. So um, in the future, obviously, I'll probably go ahead and uh, do one of those dungeon runs and see what we can find. Uh, let's see if we can find another quest around here. This one is going to harass me. The guild has need of you, comrade. Do you know how long I've been uh, looking run. for you? Don't they know stalking is wrong? There is an NPC here, it looks like. I wonder if this would be a good spot. It looked like it was right out here, but maybe not. No. Oh, is it inside of this? Oh, yeah, it looks like it's inside there. I mean, we could talk to the bank person if there is. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's this thing here. Oh, housing brochure. Oh, okay. So this is the same thing we already have. I guess we can do that then. Yeah, we can uh, We can go to Ebonheart and pick up a house there. Might be not a bad idea. Do you idea. know how long I've been looking for you? Every second of every day. This guy looks like he's part of it. What's this one here? For glory. Oh, battlegrounds. Oh, okay, so this is for battleground stuff. Eventually, I want to do that too, to be fair. Talk to the battle master, or whatever. Yeah. So let's keep that on its own. Maybe I'll, I mean, might even do that. I might even do that or the other thing. But the battleground will be put into the PvP category, probably. So. Honor to you, traveler. Name's Naril. I'm guessing you're new in town and need some work. It's a bit of luck we met because I need some help in a business deal. Uh, what did you have in mind? You may have heard Stonefalls is under attack. This makes some things very lucrative. Take wine. If I had a particular bottle, there's a party who'd pay well for it. 
Are you asking me to steal some wine? Please, procure. <laughs> There's a bottle of Tears of Amaya hoarded by a Nord tavern keeper here. I offered to buy, but he won't sell. Frankly, he'll never drink it, so he'd never know if it was replaced by a copy. As long as I get money, I'm good. I knew you were game. Okay, so... I'm guessing it was where we were already at. Yeah, 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 okay. That sounds like a nice easy one, too. Not much. They keep to themselves. I think they worship David. The guild requests your help. Run! Yeah, my horse is definitely much better now that we've uh, done that. Uh, Cyrodiil. Definitely the best thing I've done. Whoa. What is this? We're dealing stealing a drink, not you know. Oh, I think we're supposed to do a distraction or something, maybe. Can I just go like this instead, and they can't see me? Yeah, no one can see me. Get away from that. Oh, okay. What brings you to this stinkhole? Uh, just looking for a drink. The bartender looks quite uh, like a character. He's a blowhard, and he hates bad singing. When Valen gets soused on alto wine and starts belting out verses, look out. Okay. Oh, they're per group, I guess. Greetings, stranger. Long journey? Uh, you have no idea. Have you eaten yet? The large, foul-tempered rats on the docks taste really good. It's a pity the barkeep doesn't care for them. I don't know why. Okay, ask the bar patrons about uh, distract. Okay, so that was that one. And then we have the thing over here. Here we go. It's like, this is such an open space, and yet we're going to release this in the bar here. It's like, okay. Hey, have one with Why don't you grab a drink? Oh, I'm trying to release this, not talk to you, lady. Yeah, there you go. I love that. By the way, is this deja vu? Maybe not. I feel like I've already done this before. I don't know why. But not this part, but like... What the? What is under here? There's a quest marker, but it's like in the ground? That's weird. <laughs> we'll figure it out sometime. It's like, I don't think there's an underground, but I guess there could be. I mean, this game is pretty huge. Comrade, a word. Do you know how long I've been looking for you? Forever. Forever and ever and ever. To the deepest ends of this earth and beyond. Okay, so let's hand this one in. Do I detect the bouquet of tears of Amaya? Yeah. Ah, it's good to make new business acquaintances. Remember Naril Helleron, my friend. We may see each other again. There we go. Okay. And then, uh, let's see here. That's probably good for that. There's so many quests here, and I don't know when, where, and how, you know. I know that sounds silly, but... A lot of mage quest ones here. I wonder what these ones here. What is this place? A watchtower. Oh, it's another. What's the inn? Oh. oh, look at all the quests here. I bring an urgent message from Rhea Opacarius. She... Oh my oh, goodness. The glyphs me. hold the key. I have trained many honorable warriors, Wayfarer. As I look upon your stance, your eyes, the set of your shoulders. Yes, I see it clearly. You are the one who will aid me with this most important task. What ca task do you need help with? A former student requires my assistance, but I cannot do what is necessary on my own. You have heard that dragons threaten elsewhere? Oh my goodness. <laughs> I love you. 
I love you so much. Yeah, that was definitely, uh... Elsewhere is one of the new expansions, you know or newer, I should say. But uh, that's what they're on. And of course, the Mage Guild. You got the, the quest for the Mage Your Guild. And... Is impeccable. Oh, yeah, we had stuff for you. I'd hoped to find you here. At... Yeah, we'll, we'll do a you another time. You're, you're, you'd be definitely a big long chain. There was so oh, many quests in here. Took you long enough. Try not to lose those stones. Oh, but Abner Tharn is right here. I see my summons reached you. Good. Good. You may wonder who I am and why I sent for you. Don't. Just trust me. I have only the best interests of the Empire in mind, but we must leave now if we're going to take advantage of the situation. A situation? A situation that could end the Three Banners War and return Irene, Emmerich, and Euron to their senses. While these children squabble over territory, the common people and the Empire suffer. We need to jump on this opportunity. Yeah, this is a pretty big, uh, sounds like a pretty big one there. Interesting. If you came for craft, you must be here to learn the craft, yes? Your alliance covers my considerable fees, allowing me to impart my knowledge at no cost to you. If you prove yourself... Oh, so this is crafting rights, yeah, so that's for crafting. Yeah, I just wanted to check, because there were so many of these NPCs around. And Finally! I, just... I was beginning to think you'd never show up here. Who are you? Glad to see that my calculations and speculations proved correct. I assumed you'd eventually show up here, and as usual, the great mage was right. Now, come closer. We have much to discuss, you and I. I recently received a message that was apparently meant for you, from an oracle. It came to me in a most unsettling manner. Anyway, I determined the chances of meeting you here, and there you are. Saves me the trouble of crafting a message stone. Tell me about this message. Well, I was about to portal to Eleanor for a proper meal. But since you're here now, we might as well discuss that message. It came from Mariv, an oracle of the weird. I usually avoid soothsayers. But Mariv possesses a genuine talent. Let me guess. Prologue for something? Oh my goodness. I'm gonna stab you. I'm gonna stab you. I'm gonna stab you. I'm gonna stab you. The Raven Watch Inquiry, huh? Okay, well, apparently, Major City is all prologue starting things. Probably DLC uh, chapters. It makes sense, honestly, but I was hoping, you know, hey, maybe there wasn't all that just that here. Do you know how long uh, but, I've been yeah. looking for you? That's why I'm looking around. I've been looking for, like, anything that might not be related to a prologue or starting, but apparently, I'm not doing such a good job there. Uh, so let's get out of here. Let's go collect our house then. We'll do that now. It's not a big deal, obviously. It's just, you know, I thought, hey, I'll check out what's Traveler, out there. A moment of your time. Dragons. We're in your running low on time now anyway, so sorry, buddy. Looks like we'll have a few places out here, though, we can check out later. Okay, so let's go here. We're going to do that housing thing. There's an urgent task for you. How about an urgent butt out? Have we met? I don't remember. Do, 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 do. There you go. You have a look about you. Some sort of quality that's rare to find. And trust me, I'm never wrong about these sort of things. Can I interest you in a room at the local inn? Actually, wait, that came out wrong. No, no, I came right. I'll take it. Look, empty rooms are just bad for business. The upkeep alone costs me more than the place is worth. But I think we can come to a sort of arrangement. And not the sort of arrangement that involves a few drinks. Let me be clear about that. Aw. Uh, what sort of an arrangement? I need someone to improve the reputation of my properties. A hero type who people look up to. And I have a feeling about you. You've done something great and are probably on the way to do something greater. Seems like we can help each other here. What's that smell? Uh, I'm interested in what are the details. Yeah, all right. Details. 
I can see how this might be a bit sketchy, but don't worry. The in-room is well-kept, conveniently located. I know you adventuring types wanting a home in every town. This would be a nice addition to your holdings. Uh, is there a catch? What is it? No catch. I just need someone to freshen up my image. And my gut tells me you're the one to do that. As long as you're not planning on turning it into a skooma den or an outlaw's refuge, the room is all yours. Hmm, doesn't sound good. So with legal reason, I can do whatever with this place? Oh, sure. You can set up some crafting stations, house your pets, display any treasures or trophies you've come upon in your adventures. Hey, you can even set up a target dummy to practice combat. Just don't demolish the place and we're good. All right, I accept your offer. Excellent. You won't regret this decision, I swear. <laughs> Here's the deed and key to the room. Took me a while, but I finally was able to take them back from the last tenant. Required more time in the sewers than I had hoped for, but hey, that's business. <laughs> Hope the room is to your liking. With your reputation, I'm sure you shouldn't have any trouble with the neighbors. If you do, remember death threats are not the way to go. Had a spot of trouble when my last tenant started sending those out. <laughs> Nope, just make yourself at home. Spruce things up a bit. Honestly, I can't wait to see how you arrange the place. Hopefully you'll end up with a few less Daedric shrines than another former tenant of mine. Like zero. Zero is a good number. Of course, I don't even worship Daedra. Oh, what a relief. I can't tell you how hard it is to wash bloodstains off of cobble floors. But that's not even the worst of it. I've had tenants cram their rooms with the wildest things. Mounts. Foliage, assistance. I mean, it's an in room. <laughs> Do you own the place? I own this and several other properties throughout Tamriel. It pays to diversify. Of course, that means I've got to look out for a variety of troubles, too. But hey, no one ever said the real estate business was easy. Goodbye. So, is this the door to it? or Oh, yeah, here it is. So, this is our access to our home. Now, I've already done this before, so uh, this is pretty much as far as I got down in the past, but uh, I did get uh, this in-room in the past, so we already placed the bed. You remember we got a, a pet, a bed and a blazer or whatever you can place down? So here's a storage coffer, too. I don't know where this was. It was part of the, the placement, I think, when you hit F5 or something, but uh, yeah, okay, you can go to Browse, so you can see different things like trophies. Um... Mounts, non-combat, uh, I think you can do your own inventory. I just don't know how that works, to be honest. Oh yeah, here, lighting, oh here you go. So here's that blazer thingy mabopper. Now can I actually make this smaller? Oh no, you can do that though, that's pretty cool. Wee. Okay, so if I wanted to like, oh right click realigns it. So you can place that, it's really big for this place, but there you go. A nice little fire, mood lighting. Oh, yeah. And I guess over time, you get little trophies for doing stuff. Uh, Shadow honor and blah, blah, blah. I don't even know what that was. Probably something I did a long time ago. But uh, you can even put your stuff in here. Cool. And then you can purchase, retrieve. And there's settings in here. So you can make primary residence. So you can have accesses and visitors and different things like that, which is pretty cool. There's a pet in here. I don't even know where that's from or who that is. Maybe I put that in there from before. I don't know. Um, but that's pretty cool. So that's our free house. Now we had this other one. What's this going to work? Uh, that's lore library, I guess. That's fine. But what about... Uh, maybe you got rid of it? Oh, you know what? I think I got rid of it, so we don't have to worry about it anymore. Because we had uh, a quest in my inventory as well for doing this, so. Oh, okay, so we can just destroy this, I guess? Is that how you do it? I'm guessing you can. I don't. I don't see any other use of it, so... Destroy. Oops. I'm guessing you're supposed to. <laughs> oh, here's the quest. You already have completed this. Okay, so yeah. I guess that's the quest. So you got it from uh, your uh, when we leveled up, and then I guess you get it from there as well. So you can add those to your library if you want. I'm going to leave it alone for now. 
Okay. That's pretty cool. So I think that's it for this episode. I need a little nap. I'm really tired. I got woken up early. It was the Amber Alert. And we went, ear, 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 ear. And yeah, I didn't get much sleep. But uh, either way, my friends, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, all that fun stuff. And uh, we will see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye. <laughs>